Meantime, four days after a deadly shooting at a Dudley High School football game in Greensboro, questions loom about security for the home game this Friday. Good evening. Welcome to the Fox 8 6 o'clock news. I'm Neil McNeil. And I'm Katie Nordine. Fox 8's Madison Forsey pushed for answers today. So, Madison, what did you find out? Well, Guilford County school leaders have not given us any new information about changes to safety policies for the matchup against Northeast Guilford. We asked about additional officers, parking lot security, and limiting who can come to the game, and I did not get a response to those questions. I reached out to the Greensboro Police Department, who provides off-duty officers for some games. A spokesperson tells me there are no changes to report from their end, but they will staff what the school system contracts for them. The safety conversation comes after one person died and a Smith High School student was hurt when an unknown suspect drove through the parking lot and started shooting. That suspect also drove into two more people. District Superintendent Dr. Whitney Oakley sent out a passionate plea Monday afternoon for an end to community violence. She spoke about the gun crisis in our community and how we need to come together to address the issue. We asked to sit down with her or Dudley High School's principal to talk about the mental and emotional toll violence takes on their teachers and students and give them a chance to share that message. The district declined our request. Now, the district did share with us in the last hour they are planning to answer questions related to safety strategies alongside the Greensboro Police Department tomorrow afternoon. We'll bring you the updates from that news conference as we get them.